Kiki Palmer filed a restraining order against her ex-boyfriend, Darius Jackson, and you would never believe what he did to her. To find out more, stay tuned and watch this video. Hello everybody, welcome to the Impressive channel. A very serious story came up about the entertainer Kiki Palmer and her ex-boyfriend Darius Jackson. Now, it came out that Kiki filed for full custody of their eighth month old son, Leotis, but the story gets a lot more serious than this because according to US Weekly, Kiki also filed a restraining order against her ex Darius. This actually really surprised me because I had no idea that there was any DV going on in the relationship. I knew Darius had some insecurities and he never hit them. I mean, we all saw what happened over the summer when he went online and bashed Kiki for wearing a revealing outfit at Usher's concert. We saw what happened there and that kind of told me, okay, he's a bit insecure, but I didn't know that he was being aggressive towards Kiki. So the situation is very serious. Now, according to US Weekly, it was said that Kiki claimed that she has security footage from an incident that happened recently on November 5th, where Darius trespassed on her property without her knowledge or consent and threatened her before lunging for her neck, striking her and throwing her over the couch and stealing her phone. Kiki also alleged that there were some other instances of DV. She said he went from destroying my personal property, including diaries and prescription eyeglasses, throwing my belongings into the street, throwing my car keys to prevent me from driving away, hitting me in front of our son and spewing profanities about me to our son, threatening to off himself if I left him, harassment and other physical and emotional abuse. Now, Kiki did finally end the relationship for good in October due to his aggressive behavior. And now she is filing for sole custody of their son. And I understand why Kiki is doing this. I mean, honestly, it seems like Darius is unhinged, very unhinged. He's emotionally unstable. He has proven himself to be insecure and pretty controlling. And he has put Kiki in danger and exposed his son to this toxicity. So I could completely understand why Kiki would want to protect her son. Some people would probably assume that she's trying to keep her son away from his father. But in this situation, I feel like she's using protective measures and I think she's well within her right to do that I do think she should be granted sole custody because if Darius is showing signs of emotional instability then that should be cause for concern when this news came out Darius did hop on social media and he said I love you son see you soon so he's not planning on going away anytime soon I do hope that if he is in his son's life he will not interfere with Kiki's life. But I don't know how possible that is because he just strikes me as somebody who's unhinged based off of the new information I'm learning about him. I mean, we don't know if he will use the son as a tool to control Kiki. We don't know if he will be the type to take the son and run and keep him away from Kiki. We don't know if he's gonna try to file for custody himself so he could get money from Kiki, which probably was his plan to begin with but obviously it's not gonna work in his favor now that it's been put out there that he's abusive. But either way, you don't know what he's capable of doing. The situation is very tough and I do wish Kiki and her son peace and protection. It's very concerning, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm very concerned to hear about this and I just hope that this situation doesn't escalate to anything more serious. Now, Darius's brother, Sharonis Jackson, went on Twitter. He posted and deleted this tweet of him reacting to the news of Kiki filing a restraining order. And he said, the most disgusting, vow, abusive, manipulative person I have ever encountered in my entire life abuses almost everyone. Y'all will see, just send positive energy to the babies. Any child in the middle of something like this does not deserve it at all. Wow, so dang sad. 
Now, I didn't know exactly what Sharonis meant by this tweet. I didn't know if he was talking about his brother or not, but I did see that Darius liked this tweet. So apparently he was taking Darius's side and Kiki Palmer's mother was not here for this at all. And she decided to spill all the tea. This is what she said. Look, I've never done anything like this. I've been in this business for 22 years. I've seen a lot of stuff, but this is, this is, I, I can't help myself. For Sharonis Jackson to post on his Twitter, uh, uh, the ridiculous stuff that he's posted when he knew his brother was abusive. I went to Sharonis over a year ago and told him that his brother was abusive to my daughter. And he said, uh, well, I used to be like that too. What? So now he's posting on Twitter like he's this uh, special guy. We know he's the biggest f boy in Hollywood. He's disrespectful to women, just like his little brother. He taught his brother how to be abusive. So he don't get to act like he's this special guy. No, you're a f boy and you're a part of the problem. Kiki's mother also said this in her caption, I dare you mess with my family. Family means everything to me. You and your family act like sociopaths and like the world can't see it. You are phony and I saw you from day one. My daughter is kind and our family treated you with kindness and this is how you treat it. I won't take this laying down anymore. I'm done. So Kiki's mother Sharon has spoken and Sharonis decided to step into the shade room and this is what he said in response to what Kiki's mother said. He said, quote me, I never once said that to Sharon, not once in my life. I have never been abusive to any of the women I have been involved with. I'm not going to keep on with this circus, but Sharon, the world is about to hear your voice very soon and the threats you made to my family. Be well, everyone. I know it's easy to get caught up in this, but make no mistake that all of this is very sad. So he's threatening to release whatever voice notes or recordings he has of Sharon threatening his brother. And honestly, I don't blame Kiki's mother for threatening him because if I found out that somebody was putting their hands on my child, I would be threatening them too. And Sharonis is trying to act like he and his brother are the victims here. Well, explain this. I want y'all to look at this. Radar Online revealed these still images of Darius manhandling Kiki. This is really, really sad. And you got to think about it. Kiki tried to protect this man. She has been going through all of this behind the scenes and she tried to cover this up. She tried to keep her family together. She tried to tell us to stay out of her business. And he was doing all of this behind the scenes. This is really sad. I'm glad that Kiki has found the courage to finally stand up and say, listen, I'm not gonna allow this man anywhere near me or my son. I'm not gonna put myself or my son in danger like this. I'm going to leave. I respect the fact that she stood up and did this. I think she's making the right decision and I do wish her all the best moving forward. Anyway, tell me what you all think about this video down below. Please like, comment, and subscribe and share this video if you care. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.